So about three years ago, I was home alone and my sister friend left her shoe there. So I did exactly what you imagine I did and still have it. And I feel. Today, 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 um, I had asked y'all to send confessions, you know what I'm saying, more confessions, but AI, you know what I'm saying, so we have this list of rappers, artists, singers, I don't know, I don't even know who's on here to be honest, but I had asked y'all to send it, I had asked the sub specifically, because if I let all y'all do this, y'all would have lost your mind, I ain't gonna cap, so we have a couple confessions to listen through to through the AI, so let's see what y'all confessions is, it is anonymous, so uh, some of y'all are gonna go crazy, I'm not gonna cap, so. alright, first alert. Let me see. I'm not gonna lie. I've nutted to some fanboy pics and I'm probably Alright, so this is over. Good video though. You know oh what I'm saying? My good, video, God. good video, good video, good video, good video, good video. Why do y'all always do this? It's crazy because this is actually something that Jersey Drake would say. I ain't gonna cap. Oh <laughs> Drake would say something. I'm not gonna yeah, yeah, actually, actually, yeah. I ain't gonna hold you. This might be real. I'm not gonna lie. I've nutted to some fanboy pics and I'm probably bit one time in school <laughs> is that the end whoever put this in yeah that was that was the end of his confession whoever did this confession did not finish it bro just like com like exposed himself and then that was it not one time in school mm. i went inside the bathroom and caught right, like four right. dudes right. having a circle jerk around right. the class that angle i kind of wanted to join because she was bad what yeah, me and my brother one day to share a bed at a hotel. Okay. When we went out of town, I ended up pissing in it and blamed it on him. He got his ass beat and couldn't go to a restaurant with us. I feel like we... Okay. I feel <laughs> like... It. I didn't even know Speed was on I don't even know everybody who's on his website. But I ain't gonna lie. El Mans? Have ain't we that not? his brother? Yeah, that's his brother. El brother? <laughs> Have we low key not all kind of done that? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like not, yeah, pin something on your yeah, sibling. Is that, is that just me? I've done, I feel like I've done that maybe a few times, like when I was younger. No, no. My older brother, my, my you older brother. If you your siblings, then you didn't have siblings. My older brother, um, one of my older brothers used to really like, I wouldn't say bully us on some, it's on some, on some Greg Hefley, uh, Roderick type shit. You know what I'm saying? So, um, one of the times I ended up doing something, I forget what it was. I couldn't even tell you if I wanted to, but I ended up doing something. And then my mom got mad. And she's like, yo, who did this? And I just pointed to him and I don't know why, but my mom believed me. You know, he got in trouble for it. And I didn't feel bad about it because he was, he was bullying me. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> I mean, it just, it just, sometimes stuff like that happens. You know what I'm saying? One time I used a mystery oil to beat and it burnt like shit. You use a, what is mystery oil? <laughs> what is, it was a mystery. <laughs> what is, what is mystery? Crisco? We're using Crisco. <laughs> Windex, <laughs> battery, vegetable, <Metal oil. laughs> car coolant, olive oil. Bro, what, what oil it was bro using? Uh, Fabuloso, fat. Yo, come on, canola, bro. What type of oil was bro using? What's uh, this mystery white oil? White vinegar extract, pine salt, gasoline. Pines. Oh yeah, he's cooked. He's cooked. He's, he's cooked. cooked. Oil, whatever he's using, I'm not going. You should yeah, be using. Not, yeah, bro, why is he using oil, mystery bro? oil? <laughs> Bro, one lighter I'm not He went in the pantry and got that one bottle that has like no label on it. <laughs> you just use that. Alright, bro. Cantu? Cantu is not oil. What are you huh? talking about? Well, the Vicks Vapor Rub. Yo. Imagine you say, yo, you use Vapor Rub on your meat. Literally, I don't think and like I think that's, that's like nerve. Hot. That's nerve damage. That has to be permanent but nerve it's damage. It's the same like, thing bro. as the icy hot drink. No, you know what I'm bro. Like even like a, a pinky full of a Vicks yeah, vapor rub can literally <laughs> affect you for the whole day. You ever put vapor rub on your neck because you were sick or something, and then you can smell it the next day, bro, and it's gone already. Like the shit is actually strong as fuck. I don't know what they put in that joint. Stole some candy from my dad. Okay, first, <laughs> who the fuck? Who the fuck is Cardi's this? Damn man, calm down. Who, who, this is not Cardi. Who the fuck? Who, wait, hold on. Who is who? Who is this? Who is this? Oh, that's yeah. supposed to be. Cardi? Yeah, is this supposed to be Cardi? Who is this? Stole some candy from my dad, and my sister got blamed for it. They still don't know, so I'm not telling. Bro, how that is not you? Cardi. Like, <laughs> that is... Like, I don't. I don't know who that fuck. That is not Jordan Carter at all, nigga. That's fucking Playboy Smarty, my nigga. I'm not gonna catch you. <laughs> I put rat poison in a whole friend group's food at school, in GTA, because they were spreading rumors and getting me in trouble on purpose. And no, I don't regret it. 
But you know that like that's dead that ass is illegal. Quite literally, yeah, that's illegal. illegal. That's actually illegal shit. You know you can go to jail for this. Isn't that like that's po- you literally poisoning somebody? Like they pat shouldn't don't you like die off rat poison type shit? Or do you get like some kind of like you have to be in the hospital for like at least a week off rat poison? Yeah. Attempted murder type shit. Just like me for real, y'all. The, y'all it just depends like on how much she put. If you put a lot, yeah, you're cooked. You're hospitalized. Where but you if she put a little, you might be just sick at the most. This has to be a New but York. Either way, like <laughs> I can tell whoever did this is a New York based confession. Because where are you getting rat, rat poison in your house? Why do you just have rat poison in your house? There must be rats just running in and out of your mama yeah, crib. If good you just had the rat poison, where did he get the rat poison? I'm saying, like, he is a, a middle schooler. Where is he getting rat poison? My cousins used to live with us. And we were all playing outside once, and some homeless guy walked into our house to use the bathroom, and I didn't know, and walked in and watched in shock. Do you just watch the homeless man with his cheeks out, Pete? By the way, this is completely... No, hold on. (laughs) How did the homeless man get in your house? You didn't lock the door? I think they said they invited him in, right? I'm not gonna lie, my parents did that once, like a long time ago. There was a homeless man in? I don't know if he was homeless or he was old, but we didn't know him. I'm not gonna cap to you. And then, like, he just used the bathroom and he left. Yeah, I ain't never did no shit like that. I'm not going to lie. Hold on, let me, let's play that back one cousins time. used to live with us, and we were all playing outside once, and some homeless guy walked into our house to use the bathroom. Oh, no, he was not invited. That nigga was not invited. <laughs> he just I'm not came gonna, in. He just walked in. He just walked He was not invited in at all. I'm not going to cap to you. I ain't going to lie to you. Obama just let them in. That's that's crazy shit out of Obama. I ain't going to cap. I don't think he let them in. They Charles was good. Know, and walked in and watched in shock. I sleep with a teddy bear. His name is Twinkles. <laughs> um, that sounds so crazy being said from Obama. <laughs> that literally sounds insane. Hey, do y'all still have a security item? Like a security? I used to have a security blanket. No, I had a security. I have. A, I had a security pillowcase when I was younger. When I was like, what is in it? It was just literally, rocks. Literally, literally with security, we gonna beat somebody. It with? was literally a security pillowcase I had when I was like six or something like that. What? Is, what is? I'm not understanding why is it security? It's security, because somebody pull up on me. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? It's security because it was never washed. Oh, yo, yo, ever ah! for years and years, it had never touched the washer. So you came near me, you you fire, roll that joint up. Fire, fire. Fire, you know what I'm saying? Hit somebody with it. The fire, steps gonna kill him fire, before the impact fire, you. You know what I'm saying? Fire, it's already like fire. that. Security used condoms. What's wrong with you? First of all, why is your out of all articles on the bed? Why is the pillow that smelling bad? <laughs> like, what are you doing? <laughs> I was like six. You know what I'm saying? I, I what does that mean? <laughs> I can't answer questions, bro. I, I gained consciousness at four. You know what I'm saying? So I can't. I can't answer no questions from that how long ago. You know what I'm saying? I don't I just, I just remember that to be a fact. Bro, using it with Vicks Vapor Work. Not using it with Vicks. <laughs> the pillow was yellow. No, the pillowcase was actually brown. I'm not going to catch it. It was, it was dead oh. as brown. Hey. But it wasn't brown. No, no, no. I don't want to hear nothing. <laughs> it wasn't. But hold on, hold on, hold on. Why was it? Wh- where was the pillowcase? Was it on your bed? I would sleep on an actual pillow, but I just had the pillowcase next to me. Hey, hell no. <laughs> hell no. Hell no. <laughs> what do- it's I feel like this is where you should stop the story. No, <laughs> it's like, just I, getting I, worse I, and worse. I, I was six. Ain't no, ain't no shame in my game, bro. This is like over almost two decades ago. Um, And then my brother, my little brother, who's right under me, he oh, had a joint. Man. He had a, a, a cover. It was like this woven, like crocheted cover. And it was called uh, Moto, I think. You know what I'm saying? It was called Moto. The thing is, his joint was weird because he used to bite on the joint. He used to, like, bite on the covers. And he used to shit on the covers. So he used to, like... <laughs> like, like no, 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 no. What? What do you mean? Hey, he man. was three. Back when I was in third yes, grade, yes, I was bullied by two girls. I was a small boy, and they were pretty much stronger than me. How do you get bullied by two girls? and mentally. The teacher in control oh, yo, yo. wouldn't even do anything either. The one thing about teachers is a lot of teachers don't be like doing shit. One time a few years ago, I was just leaving elementary. A girl asked me out and I ran away. We were playing Fortnite and they said, Royal, they're all girls run away. We still lost the fucking game. Did anybody understand? Yeah, the- wait. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on, was he in school? He said he was in school, he got asked out, and he ran away. Then he was playing Fortnite, 
and I'm guessing they were up against girls and he ran away and he still lost? Like, what is going on I in this story? Know. Pin of shame, by the way. Pin of shame, by the way. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. Pin Next person to do it, you're getting banned. One time, a few years ago, I was just leaving elementary. A girl asked me out and I ran away. We were playing Fortnite and they said, Royal, they're all girls. Run away. We still lost the fucking game. I'm not gonna lie, I still don't know what the I fuck still don't know what he's talking about. I still don't know what he's talking What is about? I don't know. What is he talking about? I'm makes no sense. I'm not gonna lose. I don't know what he's talking about. Bro, I had a spelling, uh, a spelling error in the sentence. It fucked up the AI. The AI didn't know what to do. Last year, I really liked this emo girl. We both hit it, it off the times weird. we met in person. The last time we met was in September, but I didn't ask her out. A week afterwards, my friend started dating her. Damn. Okay, chat. This is y'all. This is y'all. This is a uh, question of the day. If you like a girl, but you're not shooting the shot, and your man, like, say it's like eight months at this point, you're not really shooting the shot like that. If your man goes and tries to go shoot his shot at the girl, is he wrong for shooting the shot at the girl when you take in like a decade? He says to go? eight months. Yeah, let's like, like, let's say eight months. Well, first of all, me personally. Well, no, also, no, also, no, 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 it's not, it's gonna take me, if I'm talking to somebody, I'm not getting a relationship with them with, yeah, exactly. within eight I'm months. Yeah, I'm not getting no relationship. But I'm you should, even. within eight months, you should be like, you should be having conversations with them. I'm saying if you not, like, if you like, oh, I like that girl, but you're not talking to them at all, you're not even talking okay. to them. But I'm talking like that, not eight like relationship. Eight months down the line, are we like, you know what I'm saying? You let's know what I'm say, let's replay that just to really see what, because really is he already, you know what I'm saying? I really like this emo girl. We both hit it off the times we met in person. The last time we met was in September, but I didn't ask her out. A week afterwards, my friend started... Okay, so it sounds like they hit it off prior things, but he didn't ask her out in September. So, what do y'all think? What do y'all think? <laughs> Just based I mean, on you that. You don't have to ask a girl to yeah, you be don't. your girlfriend to be doing boyfriend and girlfriend things. So Eight, eight months is almost a year. What is he? Sure. I feel like he just. I don't know what he's talking about when he means hit it off. Like, that yeah, I, mean, I don't know either. That that's what mean that's, that's, we did something, or we just went on a date and we had a good time. Like, you kind of got to classify. Because if y'all already doing something and then long. your man is dating her, then you know what I'm saying? He see, he took too long. Moms make a good point. To be fair, sometimes somebody just going to take your bitch. I'm not saying it should be your man's, but. It happens. Just friend. Child, I'm going to you. Moho like me. I'm not dating. Like, it, it takes me a while to start dating somebody, bro. I'm not going to I can't care, do. Bro. A nigga can take my bitch tomorrow, bro. Okay, cool. I'm going to get, get another one. <laughs> get a new one. Me, I waited 12 months before making an official. I feel like. I feel like that's a good thing to wait, you know, like just to talk, just to get to know the person, not just rushing into the relationship. But like, if you're waiting 12 months to talk to somebody, like 12 months to get it serious, like, yeah, like, you, talk, like, I feel like the talking stage should be way before even his eight months. Not talking about relationships, just talking stage. Like you need to actually be trying to I feel like this pursue is something. Only a violation if they're already doing yeah. boyfriend and girlfriend stuff. And then he just came in and like mm. did that because that's supposed to be a dog. I use all of my female friends for sex, and none of them know that I am fucking all of them individually oh. on different dates. My goal is to hear all my female friends moan for me. Uh, okay. Um, so, you know, we all have different goals. What buttons uh, What buttons do what? End stream, start stream, switch screen, main screen, um, sound, 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 end stream, sound. Royalty free sound, SpongeBob sound, um, sad music sound, band sound, mo well, band icon. Damn, you ain't got like a hip hip hooray sound. No. Hey guys, <laughs> bro. I mean, that's kind of uh, nigga. That's not. I'm not gonna lose you. We all have different goals in life, but if your goal is to hear each of your your female friends moan, like that's like the main goal is to hear all your female well, friends first, moan. I mean. If we're talking about it in this sense, those people aren't his friends. You know what I'm saying? He playing. He, he playing. He playing the friend tactic. He playing the let me be your friend, and then I, um I'm gonna try to like cross over into 
that territory. Which I don't. That's not my method. I I don't like the friend method. I don't want to be friends with anybody I'm talking to. Doing that. I think he's just using that as a label because. So he's using it as leverage. That's what he, that's what he's doing. That's exactly that's exactly what he's saying. I guess maybe I don't know. I do too. Dingy ass go. This nigga a slut. Uh, maybe I'll do that method. Best goal to be honest. It's none of my business. Rumble. Yo, come on, come on. Bro. <laughs> I thought my boyfriend was cheating because his phone kept getting notifications. So I broke his PlayStation Five. But I pray this is cat. I pray this is cat. I pray this is cat. You know what's you know what's crazy guy. about this? I pray. <laughs> She didn't even say that she checked it and went through it and he was cheating. She just said it kept getting notified. He wasn't cheating. <laughs> it's like, was cheating she I pray this is cat. Please let this be cat. Well, she gonna say, whoa, 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 before you click it, she gonna say she checked it and he wasn't cheating. But it turns out it was his mom trying to reach out. <laughs> look, look, bro. Ain't no way. Yo, okay. um, oh my goodness, bro. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. Chat, y'all like niggas be people be insecure, bro, and it really shows, bro. Now, I'm not telling you, I'm not saying niggas can't need reassurance or anything like that, but bro, confirm your shit, confirm your shit. How do you not even confirm this shit a hundred percent, and then you start breaking niggas' property and shit like that? What is wrong with what is wrong with people, bro? Some of you, I'm not going. Some of y'all don't need to be in relationships, bro. Did not think it all the way through. I don't know. You lucky this anonymous thing. God really put you on blast right now, or 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 sis. You know what I'm saying? But look, like, what's wrong with what's wrong with y'all? You know what I'm saying? Like, you're all like your your friends, you know, for yourself, man. I thought my boyfriend was cheating because his phone kept getting notifications. So I broke his PlayStation Five, but it turns out it was his mom trying to reach him a little. She did. Oh. Mid confession. That shit just pissed me off. She said low at the end. Oh. Oh my god, yeah, that that's that therapy, crazy, nigga. Man. What's wrong with you? That's crazy. That's that's been saying I'm like, well, <clears throat> I did school once and got my ass whooped so fucking hard. I don't understand that uh, word yeah, that well, nigga huh? said. Can well, we that? got my ass whooped. <laughs> yeah, why he say ass like that? Too? PlayStation 5, but it turns out it was sub his up, mom trying to reach him a little. In mid confession, I did school once and got my ass whooped so fucking hard. That just sounded gay. I'm like, I don't know. I don't know what, I don't know what he said. I don't know what he said. <laughs> but really. I'm concerned. That's not party, bro. I saw my homie hey, get beaten up in GTA by this big ass sixth grader when he was an eighth grader over my homie stealing. By the way, that's actually pretty good AI. I'm not gonna hold you. Of Andrew I did school once and got my ass whooped so fucking hard. Color Joe Bugatti. Right. I saw my homie get beaten up in GTA by this big ass sixth grader when he was an eighth grader over my homie stealing his jacket. Damn. Would have helped or something, but I was absent and saw only the video. Damn. One of my it's always those days you absent where everything <laughs> just happened. Niggas fighting. Uh, somebody came to school with pizza and shit like that. Drake performed at, at homecoming. Like, where you at, man? The whole cafeteria <laughs> blew up. <laughs> it's always those days you're not there, man. When your man's get jumped on the day, you're not there. It's tough. It's tough. Best friends is suicidal. Oh. And I've never told them how much I hate that they hurt themselves, and I feel guilty because I've never actually told them how I hate it. The worst thing you can do is not communicate with somebody who feels like that. Like that, not communicating with them is probably the worst thing you can Two do. In my phone cap, blue games. Maybe for three months. Not communicating with with somebody who's in that type of situation is probably the worst thing you can do. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you really somebody friend type shit. I'm not. It's not. I'm not saying it's your duty to go save a nigga. Nobody gotta save nobody, but you like gotta go and help your people out in whatever way. Now, how specifically you need to help them out? It depends on what the situation is. You know what I'm saying? But like, don't like not say nothing. Let's continue to it is. When I was around nine years old, me and my best friend broke her mother's wedding ring, and we kept it a secret between us. And after a while, we had it made into part of matching necklaces. Um, How the fuck did they do that? <laughs> First of so all, again. this nigga sounds like a speed impersonator. Impersonator it like, speed. It sounds like, like white boy. Like, it sounds it really, <laughs> sound like this isn't speed. This is definitely white boy. This is, like, this, are you serious right now, bro? This is, this is dead ass you white mean. boy. Are you serious right now, bro? That w is, two months. They give me the two buzz. They give me the two buzz. W biz. W biz. In fourth grade, I caused a girl to get jumped by the popular girls. Short story, she got bullied and I told her to stand up for herself and she ended up getting jumped by all the popular girls. I guarantee you ain't jump in, you ain't you help her, you ain't break it up, you ain't nothing like that. That's actually fucked up. You actually fucked up you and being for that. 
How you gonna be like, yo, this is why I gotta be telling y'all, don't always try to take everybody's advice. Yeah, man, the nigga literally instigated this person into getting to a fight. Yeah, man, handle that shit, man. Don't let them, hey, you a real ass nigga, you gotta stand up for yourself, bro. You a real ass nigga, stand up for yourself, fight. Fight that nigga right now. Yeah, he ain't gonna do nothing. You gonna win too, I guarantee you. As long as you believe in yourself, you gonna, the nigga got his ass. And this reminded me of that one clip where the guy was like getting arrested by the police, mm -hmm. or like they weren't gonna arrest him. And he was like, don't let them run off with it. And he goes to hit the car door and they start, they start arresting him. Bro. I was taking a shit in school. <laughs> I did not know he was on here. I, I've seen everybody thus far because I looked at it earlier, but I did not know he was on here. Jesus Christ, that just called me off guard. I was taking a shit. <laughs> that just called me the way off guard. I kept getting jumped by all the Jesus popular God. girls. I'm in pain a lot for some odd reason, but I've never told my parents because I'm a dumbass and kind of scared to. I was taking a shit in school, and it was top five scariest things ever, niggas. We're banging on the stall that didn't have a locked BTW, and a weird-ass nigga was waiting for me to get out BC. Dude. Hearing Donald Trump say, niggas, this is crazy. Oh, my God. Panera. After that legacy, bro. Oh, my goodness. WSP Raya, WSP Miles. This nigga was pray to God. What's good, bro? Once a nigga tried to fight me in the bathroom, but I wasn't so. The nigga that had grabbed me offered me a kiss because I stared at him with intention to harm. We were both dudes. I'm still gay, though. I made it. Skip. I'm so lost. To be gay at the girls' sleepover. I lost all my dignity, though. Y'all, do people really do that? You act gay to go to the girls' Dude, sleepover? Do people? It's not worth. Is that is that a is that a real thing? Because what do you? Yeah, hold on. Let's actually think about this. What do you do once your cover is blown? Or when you blow your cover on purpose, like how how do you even go about that situation? You be seeing uh them that that one game motherfucker who be with Ruby Rose and he be like touching her ass and she be throwing it back on him and he be cool. That's what niggas say he low key undercover type shit. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, I don't know if that's the type of time in that. What do you gain? Nothing. Hidden dip. Motherfucker getting temporary butt. It's not even real butt. Bro just getting like like at the most broken touch some shit. Like he might actually he might actually be on that side of the fence. I ain't gonna lie. Be watching too much corn. I assume it's a joke because you literally gave nothing. They not finna yeah, fuck you. you. Exactly. Free trial booty. What the fuck, bro? Ain't too much fruit loops to see some breasts. Google, Twitter, bread. Like nigga, what is that going to do for you, nigga? But a fucking like five second boner, my nigga. So about three years ago, I was home alone and my sister friend left her shoe there. So I did exactly what you imagine I did and still have it, and I feel. Which one? That is probably the probably one of the most down bad acts you can commit as a human being. I honestly think jail sentences need to be behind this. I really do. I really do. Sick. When I was 12 and hitting puberty, I was never taught human anatomy. So I thought everyone had willies and tried to riz up a girl saying, I want to suck your willy. She then laughed and I switched schools. It seems like we skipped a part of the story there. <laughs> but, nah, for real. Like, it seems like we skipped a part of the story there. But doesn't everybody take that class in like fifth grade? Yeah, or am I supposed to take human grade. anatomy? Yeah, bro missed yeah. class that day. He was asking. Yeah, bro, bro, can you imagine? <laughs> bro was sick that week. Yeah. That's your cut. That week or two week period when you're learning about anatomy and shit, you just miss those two weeks. Like, you don't know what the fuck is going on. <laughs> Oh shit, they're gonna be fucked for life, I'm not gonna lie. That's <laughs> tough. No, that's that's like I said. My shit was in my shit was in fifth grade. We learned about it in fifth grade. Yeah, it was in fifth grade. They I think put out that big ass fucking uh wheelie fucking yeah. TV oh my and God, put the damn bro. projector on Yo, the wall. <laughs> nigga, I was fucked up, nigga. I, I didn't know what the fuck was going on, bro. I was they pulled out that that drum. I was like, <laughs> nigga, I was know. like, what the fuck nigga, going on? I didn't know what was going on, bro. I ain't gonna cap to you. Um, all right, let's continue now. So last year I rizzed up a girl I like, BTW. Who the fuck is yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that? It's not that boy. Nigga. That's a NFL young man. Who, who <laughs> is this nigga, bro? Taught human anatomy. So I thought everyone had willies and tried to rizz up a girl saying, I want to suck your willy. She then laughed and I switched no. schools. So last year I rizzed up a girl I like, BTW, she's 6'5", I'm 5'7", and she said yes, and just to keep it classy, sex is very weird, and she freakishly strong and holds me like a girl, I feel emasculated. <laughs> I mean, some people, some people like, some people like that, bro. If you like it, bro, then I mean, you, 
If you like it, I love it, man. You know what I'm saying? Like some people like that. He be jumping into her arms and Yo. shit. I'm not gonna with you. Look at you. His tiptoe is trying to. <laughs> she, 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 <laughs> no, I'm not gonna lie. You're cooking. I'm she, not. You're picking this nigga. I'm not gonna lie. Oh shit! Yo, you, you gotta, people, you gotta move on. Some bro. people can't, some, can't do that. Hey, some people are into that. Some people are into the to the to the uh, to the shit. Some people are into that. You know what I'm saying? He walks behind her on the street like. That nigga, bro. What are you doing if a girl slaps your ass? Is the other way around, my nigga. Like, you know what I'm saying? She she wear the pants in a relationship. It's all good. It's all good. You know what I'm saying? Just accept that. There's no. Some people are like that. You know what I'm like that. My first memory of my whole life is waking up on like my fourth birthday, and I went outside to shit my pants. Thanks. I accidentally told my friend's ex that he was seeing her friend. What do you mean accidentally? <laughs> what the fuck? My first memory of my whole life is that. waking up on like my fourth What's birthday my first and I went outside to life? shit my pants. What is your first I, memory of your life? I, I can't I gotta think. Well, now we're talking about it. I came into consciousness at age four. Um, Hold on. January. This sound like a trip. Is this a traumatic experience? January 15th, 2006. Age four. Hall Elementary School. I can't say which Hall Elementary School. It was actually a pre-kindergarten school. Um, I was there, and my cousin was there, and we were playing um, Who Stole the Cookie Out of the Cookie Jar? And then niggas said I stole the cookie out of the cookie jar, but I really didn't steal the cookie out of the cookie jar. And then the thing is about this game is that if you ended up stealing the cookie out of the cookie jar, you got no cookies, so I didn't end up getting cookies, and everybody was eating fucking cookies, and I was the only nigga in class with no cookies because niggas claimed that I stole the cookie out of the cookie jar but I didn't have the cookie in the first place and to this day that is literally the first memory that I remember of life so uh yeah one time when I was like nine I punched my tv and broke it because I lost in Mario Party well <laughs> why I spice say beat my ass why I spice say like that um I'm not gonna hold you you play uh stupid games you get stupid prizes my nigga so. for context before we had watched a documentary on the world's fastest eaters. And consistently they were serving glicks that day. So ninjas were trying to gobble that shit. Like there was no Tomaro. Bro, hold on. <laughs> hold on. Why did he put for context at the beginning? And then this once we get to the end of the sentence, there's just like no context. It's just people eating glizzies. <laughs> like, How did we get here? <laughs> where, where did we skip like a part? It was a documentary on the world's fastest eaters. And consistently, they were serving glicks that day, so ninjas were trying to gobble that shit. Like, there was no Tomaro. Nigga, what? I know this guy who had a crush on my best friend. Well, I like this AI. Nice mm -hmm. AI. Good AIs. Oh, friend, he would call her chain. goddess, and it would weird me out. Yeah, come on. Because someone snuck it in my food. I've never slapped someone so fast in my life. I know this guy who had a crush on my best friend. He would call her goddess, and it would weird me out, and then I kept telling bro that there's other girls out there, but he didn't take my advice. P1. He won? She said, hold on, she what said he won? won? I don't know. I know this guy who had a crush on my best friend. He would call her goddess, and it would weird me out, and then I kept telling bro that there's other girls out there, but he didn't take my advice. P1. He won. He won. Goddess he win? By the way, is Riz, question mark. <laughs> the nigga was trying to play the the best friend game. It seemed like nigga, because why were you defending? Why were you trying to like? He can't date your your best friend or something. Where he can't like he can't like. Right, she don't. He said P one. Oh P one. I have to part confess one? something. Nigga, ain't no part two, nigga. I thought I was gonna be rich. Real simply here, just wanted to say that my brother sucked his own dick before he told me this. I don't if I should believe him or nor, but if he did, I want to learn how. Hey. Real simply, we know it's you, nigga. You snitched on yourself, nigga. We know it's you, nigga. We said we, you said your name. We know it's you, nigga. <laughs> nigga, boy, skip the stream. If you're watching this on YouTube, you ride. Turn the blue in the description. Come to the stream. Don't miss the stream. Be a part of shit like this. You know what I'm saying? I be busy. All right. <laughs> Everybody, she at least I want by. My dad, I'm not passing that